Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at Project Grove, the prologue. I want to thank Antler Studios for providing me a copy of this game that I'm playing on Steam. I'm already in the options here. Subtitles are on. We're going to leave motion blurs like that. Graphic settings are high. We'll leave it as is, recommended by the game. Keyboard and mouse, we're going to do it. New game. I'm not sure how long the prologue is. We're definitely going to show you guys a bit of gameplay here today. If you guys like any games, please make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, turn on that notification bell. It does help me a lot, and we're trying to get to a thousand subscribers this year. Anyways, let's go. Stay slot number one. Loading. For eight years, the Empire has been ravaged by a mysterious plague from the west. The Great Rot has touched all strata of Imperial society. Princes and peasants. Princes and peasants. Industrialists. Even the jugglers have not been spared. Potentium Co. were tasked with the investigating the forest of Drakimra, which, according to the various men in pubs, was the likely origin of the rot they called the expedition. Project Grove. Here we go. At Potentium's behest, alchemist Edric Tate journeys to the forest his mission, investigate the potential of Dracuma's flora and creating a cure, and unlike previous candidates, that's a little bit fast. Right. Let's get on with this. All right, let's do it. Let's get on with this. So mouse, keyboard. Bit of a stutter. Not too bad, though. This is the prologue beta as well. Activate this. Good morning, Edric. Are you ready for the first day of this expedition? I am. Right then, Elpin. My mission, dangerous as it is urgent, is to study the rare flora that grow here in Dacrima. Document them, analyze them, and assess what connection they have to the rot, with a goal of eventually curing the disease. A worthy task for my alchemic acumen. That was quite the exposition, Dumpedric. Potentium have left us a briefing that may help us initialize our adventure. Haha. <laughs> well, I probably should take a glance at it. Although, where did I leave it? Where did you leave it? Check the faxophone, the laboratory. Check the save point. Alright, so the faxophone's right here. Don't touch that faxophone, Elpin. I don't want to end up ringing that HR woman again. All right, so this way it looks like. All right, maybe through up here first. How do I get out of here? This is locked. Ooh, yeah, I heard that cracking. I heard the crack. You know, I've absolutely no idea what this machine does. It saves. So if you die, absolutely no idea. I like the music. It's really, uh, really, like, I, I don't know how to put it. It's like fun and quirky, I guess. All right. Hello. The briefing is printed on paper, not dangleberries, Edric. Yes, yes, I know. Though I should definitely keep an eye out for similar samples to this when we're out in the forest. So now where do I go back in here? It looks like back here. Aha! Of course it's here. Knew I'd found a use for it. I to open your inventory. There you go. Aerial surveillance of the landing area has observed two areas of interest. A strange touch statue ruin west of the landing zone and a rot infection to the east surrounding a big dead tree. A bot sent to initially investigate suffered deer-related damages, and returned no substantial evidence. Uh, and returned no substantial intelligence other than alchemic readings that suggest possible proximity to a flora magica. Human investigation was not possible at the time, as Jerry made a joke about it being a bad elder deer, and I had to eject him from the plane. Potentum. Recon pilot. All right. It's two rot infected locations and a possible flora magic nearby. Should we investigate? I think we have to. Right down the winch. All right. So we got to go through here to the first first floor. 
What is that? That is not a bird. That doesn't look like a bird. It looks like a stingray that flies in the air. It's exactly what that looks like. Yeah. This is about to get crazy, I think. Uh, yeah. All right. Let's, uh, let's go down this way. Go down. Look at the wheel. I've already forgotten what we're doing. A good thing you've marked the details of the expedition in your journal. All right, tab. I already remember what I'm doing though, so I, I don't need to look at this, but yes. So next up, we need to go to the... Scan the chat statue and find the tree. So I want to go... Oh, you know what? I just realized my compass tells me, so I was going the wrong way, first of all. But my compass tells me, so we got to go this way. I, I... Thank you, Antler, so much for allowing me to show off this prologue. I'm loving the way it's playing so far. And again, I'm liking the music. All right, no, we got to go this way. We're gonna go check out one thing and then the other. Landmark. That must be the statue. Nope. Yep, I right hear. Oh, dear. See what I did there? Dear person, statue discovered. Hold and release to direct L pin scanning to unlock. Alright, so. Find and scan a statue. This Elpin is the work of the old one, the people that lived in Dakrima nearly a thousand years ago. Note the location of the statue. I may wish to return here later to study this further. Dear lady statue thing position noted. All right, can you scan these deers? Yo, stop. All right. You can scan these instead. I very much enjoyed this scan. Ferns con read the entry. All right, so we want to go to the tree, right? Which is this way. This will come in handy. Collected Tom. Scan complete. I'm gonna take these. Oh, what's this? Let's keep exploring this forest. I think we're almost at the tree here. It looks like it might be past this. We're looking for rot though. I haven't seen any rot yet. Is that rot? Is this it right here? One has to marvel at the robustness of alchemic infections. The way they can affect everything from cats to petunias to this great tree set before us. Aren't you worried about getting infected, Edric? A moot point, Elpin, as I'll be synthesizing a cure very shortly, no doubt. Edric, I'm detecting alchemic readings up on the ridge. A possible flora magic car. Okay, so now I gotta go this way. Yep, that way. Hubble bubble gather enough botanicals to brew a potion. Hey look, this is a safe point. Oh really? That's really cool. Where am I going though? This way? These guys in this elfin show signs of geological rot infection. I may be able to use them though with the right potion. Okay, so we gotta brew a potion. So I do need to get more stuff, like more 
I... You know, things like this here. This will come in handy. We're almost done. Like one more thing and I'll probably be able to brew that potion. Uh, there's something right over here. That should do. Just what I was looking for. Alright, so... Find a way up the flora. How do I craft, I wonder? Research... How do we... How do I, how do I use my book? Ah. Oh, you can swim? And there was something under there too, like a blowfish or something, like a puffer fish right there. See that? For some reason, I don't seem to be able to scan anymore though. Is that the whale again? It definitely looks nice, that's for sure. All right, I gotta figure out how to. How do I make my potion is the question. Inventory, project, all right, hold on. Inventory, research, how do we craft? Did I miss something, I wonder? That was me crouching, if you guys were wondering. Uh, yeah, I feel like... How do we craft? Alright, let's, uh... Inventory, let me pop my compass back in my hand, I guess. We're going to try and go back this way real quick. Gather enough to brew a potion. I wonder if you got to go back up. The winches over its weight capacity. What are you suggesting? He's suggesting that we're too too big. We got to we got to trim some, you know? That that's what he's saying. How do we brew potions? Bubble, bubble. Find a way to the floor. Yeah, but we're trying to brew potions right now. That's what we're trying to do. I'm not quite sure that I know how. Oh, I almost broke my legs again. Yeah, look, there's a bird here. You can chat with a bird. It sounds like a pigeon. I'm not quite sure. I... I don't think I, I read it, and if I did, I feel bad. That's cool. I'm not sure what I just did, though. Alright, not sure if that was good or bad. <laughs> We're gonna go back down again, and if I can't figure it out, we'll just save it here. And, uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. I really like the way this looks, though. It does look good. We're trying to go... Oh, I don't want to jump, though, and break my legs. So we're trying to get up there. Find a way up the flora. Well, we've tried that already. Oh, wait a minute. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. I just realized something here. I can go left. <laughs> this whole time, we could have went left. We have to go this way. There it is.
There it is. And now what do we do with this? Find a way to the floor. Yeah, I'm here. I'm at the floor. Wait, no, that not that floor? What floor then? That floor? Oh wait, no. Yeah, oh no. I don't want to break my legs. Edric, do you need assistance? No, I should be quite all right. Well, yes. Yes, sir. Uh, do the umbrella Might thing need a hand here. Can I, is that big enough? No. A little bit higher. Like right here. Thank you. Can I go a little bit higher? Can I? Alright, use it to go down too. That makes sense. So it's not too high. Ooh, what? did I just break my leg? I'm all crooked like now. Wait, why did you make me do that? How do I even get back up there? Why, game, why would you show me to go down when I'm not supposed to go down? Why would you do that to me, game? I'm not sure how to do this, man. Okay, well, I might be stuck here. But you guys get the gist of the game. Play. Oh, definitely hurt my, broke my legs on that one. You guys get it? This has been Project Grove by Antler Studios. Once again, thank you so much for that. All the information will be in the description down below. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, let me know what your favorite part was other than breaking my ankles. Put it in the comments down below. And as always, for all your indie content, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, turn on that notification bell, and I will catch all you amazing humans on the next one.